you feel like uh, the game kind of took on uh, its character in the fourth quarter as far as y'all going small and having to just outscore them to win this game? Um, I thought we got some stops there on demand. You know, the, the game looked like it was closer than it was, but I thought we were going to get stops um, in the fourth. Executing our offense, getting what we wanted, taking our time, getting the shots we wanted. Um, and I thought we did a good job of defending. You know, late in the game, they made some threes and shots here, you know, they make it real close, but I thought we did a good job for the most part. That's the last minute and a half. You've been on Grand Trips. Previous two years, but being on this trip, having all these wins, getting them in so many different ways, like how did you, you know, play your role? I just want to talk, especially off the court. Um, just finding ways to do different things that keep us connected. Obviously, um, your way from your family is a little different, especially for me, with kids and wife. You've been able to kind of. Um, Use my teammates as a board and have conversations. Also, not just that, but um, enjoy the game, enjoy the process. Um, so, I think we did a great job of sticking together uh, you know, through the trip. Getting a little love on the road, how, how, how does that does that excite you when you get fans cheering from you, the opposing team's fans cheering for you? I mean, it's a blessing. You know, it's, um, I've, been a, I've, been, I've been a part of the booze and the cheer, so to be able to have it. We see you acknowledge some of the fans that kind of show you some love around around on this road trip specifically. But here, do you hear that? Are you are you? I guess you're not paying attention to that. But how, talk about how that uh, encourages you. Uh, yeah, if, man, if it does. Uh, like um, when I step on the floor, I always say like, I, you never know who's watching. Like my dad told me now when I was younger, um, playing basketball. Like regardless of whatever gym I walk into, whatever time I was playing, whoever was there, but you never know who's watching. Uh, I really take that uh, to the heart, uh, meaning that it could be a kid, a mom, a dad, whoever that may be, a grandma, a grandpa, uncle, auntie, whatever that may be, uh, sister, brother that come to the game for the first time uh, and I can afford to come to the game one time and it's tonight that i uh, coming out and then watching the Clippers and watching myself and coming to cheer for me. So anytime I get a chance to try to acknowledge as many people as I can, I try to show them a little love um, to make that moment special with them and find ways to be able to uh, make sure they remember moments like this for the rest of their life. Let's go. Anything else?